Well, there are several unanswered questions in this case still four days after the shooting happened. Um, authorities released their first account of what happened three days after the shooting. And that account was based only on an interview with one of the officers at the scene. Officer Matthew Harity spoke to investigators. They have not heard yet from the officer who fired the shot that killed Justine Damon. And that officer's name is Mohammed Noor and he has declined um, their request to come in for an interview and it's not clear whether he will ever come in for an interview or whether he'll delay it. His attorney has not answered those questions from the Associated Press. So we don't know when or if he'll give his version of events. Officer Harity, who again was driving the car at the time, he said that he was startled by a loud sound shortly before, like, and then immediately afterward, uh, Justine Damond showed up at the appeared at the window and then the shots were fired. We don't know the nature of that sound. We don't know if it was a bang, a scream, a crash. We, we don't know what, what startled that officer. We do know that Officer Noor has a couple of um, active complaints against him. We don't know the nature of those complaints. According to city records, he's had three complaints filed against him in his two years on the force. One of them was dismissed without any discipline and the other two are still active.